What's going on? My name is Chris, and welcome back to another exciting episode of Life is Strange. In the last episode, we finished off episode 3, Chaos Theory, and today we'll be starting episode 4. Quick before I start, in the last episode, I said I might replay the episode and um, change some things that I... The game messed up and wasn't my Previously fault. On Life is Strange. But you know what? I decided not to. I said it just doesn't really make sense to do that. It's what would happen in the event that this really happened, you know? I, I forgot to place the butterfly back on the fireplace, which is really sucked. That's like the number one thing I'm very sad about. I forgot Let's to take a picture. Or I didn't realize I could take a picture, I guess. You know, everything's messed up. It won't work. Everything's messed up. I know this isn't pleasant for any of us. So Ms. messed Coffee, up. Please tell us everything. What was the other thing? Oh yeah, I accidentally hey, killed the dog, maybe. That's but uh, Why the fuck are you wearing her bracelet? Calm yourself, all right? It was a gift. Once again, I just kind of messed up. My fault. Said, it's time to start the search for clues. Welcome to my domain. Let's find what we want and feed it. Max, you better come check out these files. Rachel in the dark room. Over and over. That's it. Listen, I found pictures of Rachel and Frank. Oh. Being more than a friend. I can't believe she was banging Frank. Rachel straight up lied to my face. Why didn't she say anything? Because she's a teleporting want to blame? person. My fucking dad, of course. Hello? Oh, this... I really hope because I didn't take another picture that I could go back and change things. Ever since he died, my life has been dipped in shit. Chloe, I am awesome. We are awesome. And everything Hello? changed. Are you even listening, Maxine? This is totally fucked up. What else have uh, I changed? Max Caulfield. Hold on. Oh no. Chloe, you have a visitor. I knew, as soon as we went back in that photo and we changed the fact her father didn't die, I knew, like, obviously, horrible things, the butterfly effect, man. <coughs> Excuse me, I'm a little bit sick, so, hopefully as I talk, my body will get used to the fact I'm talking. Whenever I talk a lot, when I have, like, coughing and all that, it just makes, it makes my body freak out, I go, oh my god, stop talking. But, uh, hopefully I'll get used to the fact I'm talking, because god damn, I want to play some more of this game. It's a crab, a crab, and some very poorly rendered water. Ooh, trippy! Oh boy, very pretty crab, Square Enix. I really, really, really hope some of the choices I made, like accidentally either injuring or killing the dog, and not. Redrawing the butterfly on the side. Honestly, not drawing the butterfly on the side of the fireplace and not retaking a picture are the two biggest things that we're really afraid of. Because without the butterfly, I can't be like, hey, Chloe, I'm a time traveling fool now. Let me prove it to you. And without the picture, who knows? Maybe I can't go back and maybe I'm stuck in this timeline now. But I mean, there still was a picture taken. So theoretically, I should be able to, I hope, as long as that picture exists still. Do I have to do something? What's going on here? This is a very long... Life is strange. Okay, I was gonna say... Episode 4, The Dark Room. Okay, there's been a lot of... Things talking about The Dark Room. So, I'm, uh... Curious... Photography related. I wish she could get out. That's cool. Can she talk, at least? I forget, did she talk in the last episode? I know some paralyzed people can't talk. Also, I'm really kind of weirded out that no one's doing anything about these dead whales on the beach. It's weird there you hanging go. out with you again. I know. I'm glad we are, though. It was nice that you sent me actual letters. It's more than any of my other friends have done. And you even wrote on that cool parchment paper. It's so Max. So pretentious. Wow. She's so different. I love writing on it like an English poet. You deserve the best stationery. Probably easier to write than to visit me. 
I don't mean that in a bitchy way. Not totally. You probably wanted to avoid awkward conversations like this. Uh, pretty much. Yeah. I don't know what Max Look, feels like right now. The worst thing you can do is treat me like a baby. I still want to laugh and talk shit with my best friend. Can we stop? This is seriously the best view of the sunset. What do photographers call that? The golden hour. The golden hour, See? yeah. Without you here, I'd have no clue. You just tell Max is completely out you of it. Take some amazing shots. Those beached whales are so sad. They're pretty I sad. How they feel. Aw. At least I'm alive here with you. This is why, unfortunately, I wanted to let her dad die. You're a real survivor, Chloe. I know you have to deal with so much. I don't want anybody else feeling sorry for me. I can do that. Along with my parents. My dad still feels guilty about buying me that car. Oh, she's in a car crash. Let's talk about the accident. I really want to know what happened. talk about the accident? We never actually have, huh? There's not much to say. Some prick in an SUV cut me off and I flew into a ditch. Do you remember everything? I saw everything in bullet time. I felt my back snap and... Dang. And that was the last thing I ever felt in my body. When I woke up in the hospital, I literally couldn't move a muscle. How is she Jesus. moving right now, by the way? I, I, I don't <coughs> know what to say. Don't say anything. I guess, well... I'm just... Happy I did get to see you again. I mean, how would she move her? I could have been um, vanishing out of the blue like that girl from Blackwell. Yeah. You mean Rachel Amber? I bet when she didn't. She didn't even know who she her? was. Uh, never. I yeah. just heard about her in the news. I didn't even know her name. You did. This is such a different world than when we were kids, isn't it? I, f I, I wish I could. Oh man. Like the Oh, so the snow in the, think so? the eclipse did happen still in this I timeline. I haven't kept up with the details. I have more time on my hands than you. Plus, I'm a science nerd. But none of this makes sense. It's I cool how different she is, like, personality-wise. As long as we're together, I don't feel afraid. Hanging out with you makes me feel like a total kid again. You don't even know. Listen, Chloe... I'm sorry I haven't been out to see you more. I was wrong. You're my best friend. Max, thanks for coming out to see me. You're you're doing awesome. I don't think so. Um, my I wish I could is getting cold. Maybe we should get back to the place? <laughs> Your nose. That's it cute. It is hella cold out here. Hella? I hate that word. No offense. None taken. How, yeah, how the hell does she move her wheelchair? Uh, she's paralyzed from the neck down. How in, is she like pushing her head back? Is that how she moves or something? Moving her head? Is that what the... I figured maybe the things around her head are to just keep her head centered or something. I don't know. I sure hope we can go back. I, we gotta be able to go back in time and fix everything, right? Sure, hope I'm not stuck in this timeline. I miss the cool Chloe. I mean, what was that? I saw an option on the screen or something. This is so weird. I wonder if uh, what's her face, Mary? Is that her, is that her name? The girl who killed herself. Sorry, it's been a while since I recorded. Feels like a high tech cell. But mm. I'm lucky my parents bust their ass to take care of me. I know it's hard for them. I bet it is. I wonder if she killed herself in this great in this timeline, is what I'm trying to go here. Right. Especially when they can't even take a walk alone. Mm. Sometimes I act like a total teenage brat just to give them an excuse to yell at me. Pathetic, I know. Chloe, you're a great daughter. You're kind and sensitive. When you don't even have to be. Trust me, I still get my rage on. Especially when a nurse has to watch while I take a dump so she can wipe my bum. 
Wow. The doctors flipped me around like I was a science doll. I can't even imagine. But you're still amazing. You always have been since we were kids. How do people? How do apparently Thanks, people take poops? Actually, you gotta have muscle know. control to do that. I need to get my drink on. Uh, can you can you bring me some water? Ah, uh, there you go. An excuse for us to walk around, make a wish. I really uh, let's see. I'm not gonna read the journal now, obviously. Oh, it started over. Holy crap! So much to do. I wish I could slow down time, especially to register all the cool things that have happened since I was back in Arcadia. Blackwell rules. Yes, I'm older, and thanks to Vic and Nathan, I'm now a bit more fashionable too. It surprised, uh, surprised me with the most beautiful straw pork pie hat wrapped up furrow shiki style. Best birthday present ever. Also drunkest. I can't sleep. October 4th. Hey, diary. Remember me? Busy Max. Busy. Busy. Can't right now. Must shoot. Must live. Must befriend. Should rekindle with Chloe too. But must but must vortex first. Party time. Whoa. Whoa. This is so weird. Dad? Have you special you know check your tone? Don't blow all at once. Okay, so that's the same. Oops. I'm sorry, I said I wasn't gonna check this out. This is too weird. I gotta check it out. Um Max, you busy girl, avoiding homework as usual. <clears throat> I told you I'd help you out. You never let me help. Cry face. <laughs> okay, drama, stop. You could help me by caring. I do try. By the way, I I scored that killer bud from you know who, FYI. Save me a bowl. Got a bounce. Talk to you later. Come to my room today. This is so weird. Weird. Uh, Max, thanks again for taking me to see my mom. I think she wants you for a daughter instead of me. I think not your mom is badass. Like you, you're all right, kind of like a bitch. So did I. You just didn't see me. It's okay to cry. It get it gets old. My stupid phone is about to die. So call me back. How do I? How do I go back? Is there a way to go back? I just gotta keep back. There we go. Uh, okay, I did read that one already. Nathan. Yo, yo, Max, you're around in the dark room developing shots for the contest. Sweet. So, no two whales for you. Not yet. I'll see you guys later, though. Peace out. Weird. I'm friends with them. Gross. Uh, oh, whoa, jeez. Happy birthday, Maxi. Come here, 18 whole years old. Maxi, you're busy, mom. We need to talk about some of your bills. Are you there? Yes, give me some time to answer. I just can't text every class. Some teachers get super pissed when people use their phones. Yes, because it's super rude. And please don't be so snippy. Sorry, long day of homework. You're not the only one. That, and that's why we're wondering if you need to spend... If you need to spend so much. We want you to have everything you need. But your scholarship doesn't cover everything. I said I could use your credit card when I needed it. Only bought film, not a camera. Maybe it's time to go digital. I'll call you later. I have to go. Don't pout. Love you. Hey, honey, I hope we, you don't... You didn't forget to water the plant we gave you, but don't draw on either one. <laughs> yeah, I was thinking about that. The reason why Lisa died is because I freaking just, just gave her way too much. Hey. Hello, Maxine. This is William. If you want to contact Chloe, you could use this number. She would love to hear from you. See you soon, I hope. Bye. Wow, well, I reply like half a month later. Hey, Chloe, Maxine here. I know it's been a while. I just want you to let you know I'm going to Blackwell Academy now. I hope this is still your number. Okay. Oh, geez. This is months and months and months later. Wow. Max is back. Blackwell, that's awesome. You rule. Best of all, we could hang again. So yes, it's still my number. Cool, I got a bottle of homework too, but we'll get together soon. Don't tease me, it's been so long. I know, I'll see you soon. I'm curious. Okay, well, once she had a conversation going, she actually kept replying. I kept expecting Max's answers to be like once every like month. Hey Max, it's a shame you hang out with those people. I thought you were different. Unless I saw you throw TP at me. OMG, I was so not even for you, I swear. Don't do it again. Hmm. All right. Well, snow globes are taking over. Yeah, they are. Under destiny. What's this one? Oh, it's the dough again. Oh, the snow dough. I guess not everything changed. The snow dough. Eh? I guess we don't know the significance of that Hello, yet. Hello, Chloe. <laughs> she likes fluffy animals now. Very strange. <laughs> oh, I no, still cough. can't believe I put Chloe in that chair. Not really. Some prick in an SUV, she said. <coughs> Excuse me. Accident. <coughs> looks lonely. Uh huh. 
It's nice my parents sent a card at least. Chloe, you know we love you and you're in our hearts and thoughts. We hope to see you smiling in your face soon. Please be well. Thinking I of you. Who this is. Kind of a generic card. Dear Chloe, I'm so sorry for what happened. Know that I'm here for you. If you need anything, I hope you feel better and I hope to see you soon. I Aww. wasn't very available to Chloe. Real nice. Chloe, just thought I'd drop you a quick note. You know, I'm thinking about you. I feel so lame running shit. Like, I hope you are well, etc. I know your life is different now, and I don't want you to get in get in the way of our friendship. Yes, I haven't been around lately, but that will change soon. I hope all hope you are well. Love, Max. At least I sent road trip selfies to Chloe. I'm sure that made her feel great. Aw, it's so sad. So Max, she got like. So cool that you're here again. Shut up. I'm glad you think so. Good God, I hate you. Anyways, um, <laughs> this game. Joyce and William built a whole new bathroom for Chloe. They're so great. Change his own bathroom area, gas mask optional. A weird face on the door handle or something. I should offer to put makeup on for Chloe. Not that I can, but it would be fun. Yeah, maybe I will do that. What's this? Microphone. Oh, it's used. Chloe can totally control her computer. That's neat. It's so great people get this high tech help. That is so incredible. And she can browse the <laughs> videos on the web. Chloe is still a punk at heart. Black Attic but Club. She can't hmm. stage dive anymore. No. Nope. It's so cool that Chloe has made friends online. Uh, Hot Wheels chat room. Badoof. Handybot. Miss Blue Snack. So, what are you doing? Talking with you. Haha, <laughs> no shit. I'm about to binge on Quantum Leap. OMG, love. It's got Bakula rules. So, do you. Hope we can meet soon. Not, not if you're in San Francisco. Hey, I have to take care of some body work. Let me get back. To, let me get back to you while you're binging on Bakula. You better. You better. Hello. Aw, and then she never heard from her again. What else we got here? There's the old Chloe. I wonder how long we're gonna we're gonna stick around here. Instead of handing Chloe a bong, I'm feeding her water. Did I give her a choice? It's that must be her mighty morphine machine. No more bongs for her. Nope, no. That's a that? serious heat lamp. Uh, I see. Does Chloe look at the garden and think about her childhood? Mm. She can't even feel the grass now. Oh, what well, if she stuck her face against it? Would that, like, she has some feeling in her face, I would imagine, right? That's why she can move her head. Chloe doesn't weigh that much. Oh man, she has to use that ventilator just to breathe. Oh, that's so sad. Wait, do I leave? Oh, I thought. Okay, I thought I was like leaving the room. Oh, stop making me sad, I asshole. Kept more in touch. Let's give her the dang water. Drink up, Buttercup. <sighs> oh man, no wonder my throat is dry. I don't think I've talked this much the whole year. Have you ever thought about doing a podcast or something? <laughs> I wish I could punch your face right now. A podcast? Hey, what's wrong with podcasts? A pod in a cast. Boring. Ouch. <laughs> it was just a thought. I know you're just trying to help. <sighs> yeah, that's become a bad habit of mine. Oh, you snap. sound like an adult now. It seems like I guess I can't really, life. I can't tell her I could change things. What do you remember about us as kids? We all have different memories. I think about us as little pirates running and jumping through Arcadia Bay. Me too. <laughs> but we're still pirates in our own way. <laughs> yeah, right. Check me out, Chloe of the Caribbean. No way will I get on a fucking boat now. Unless you're with me. As you can see, I can't keep all my other friends away. Hmm. Which friends did you hang out with the most? Megan Weaver, but you don't know her. Ah, she was cool. that was the other postcard. And after my accident, she was too cool for school. I know I wasn't around much. No excuses. I'm a loser. But I am trying to make things right. Oh, I didn't oh. check if I had my rewind Dude, powers. I should have done that. And I'm not trying to guilt trip you. That's what my parents are for. I know this is a dumb question, but are you lonely here? Yes, dumb question. 
I don't mind being alone. I can't exactly go party like a rock star, though. Or mm. get in any teen trouble with the folks. I think Joyce and William are incredible. Max, the accident has been so hard on them. Our insurance sucks, and the medical bills are fucking insane. The hardest part of this is... Can they pay all the bills? Um. <laughs> no way. They keep the numbers away from me, but it doesn't take much research to find out I'm costing my parents almost a million dollars a year. Holy. Oh, you're priceless. Jeez, that is a lot. Uh, no pun intended. Y yeah, um. You are such a geek. Oh, man. That's why I love I don't you. want to talk over them. I know a geek when I be one. <coughs> See, I'm practically a human entertainment system. It would be sweet to chill out together and watch a movie like when you'd spend the night at my house. <laughs> What do you want to watch? Uh, I think I'm in like a, a mellow Blade Runner mood. I always cry at the end. Plus, you know, I always wanted to have cool colored bangs like Pris. Oh! You know, you were colored hair! Incredible with blue hair. Now let's get this show on the road. And you better not fall asleep on me like you always do when we watch movies. I remember, Max. I swear I won't fall asleep. Wait, the thing is... Not yet. Even if we go back to the quote-unquote real timeline... You know, like see her as nosy as all right. You, you know, like I don't want to disappoint you. Um, Chloe would just say, you know what? Save my father's life. I will take being in this position to save my dad's life. But at the same time, you know, it's not the right thing to do. Okay, here's time to test. Do we have a rewind powers? <gasps> I'm not gonna do it. We're gonna test it out in the next episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. Be brave. If you guys enjoy, the best way to support me is by leaving a like and subscribing to my channel if you haven't already. Um, if there's any games you want to see me play, check out the top link in my description. It leads to a video where it allows you to do just that. And also, she has a, access to the outdoors from her room. That's kind of cool. Um, search. Yeah, in the next one, we will watch a movie and find out if we have rewind powers. Talk to you guys next time. Bye!